Hi guys, it's me UB Programmer and today I'm back with another project which is text to image web application and this is the project we will talk about in a bit. If you are working on any custom project, you can let me know on the uh, WhatsApp or mail me on this email address to discuss about that. Uh, if it's related to native AI lang chain, uh, Python or any other tech project. Let's get started with the uh, today's topic. So image uh, text to image conversion uh, using Gen AI or generative AI. And the model which is being used is uh, the exact stable diffusion uh, from the hugging phase. It is uh, absolutely free. You don't have to pay anything. Uh, you just uh, get started. Uh, with some requirements uh, which I will show you in detail. Okay, so we have a prompt a Muslim in a mosque and we are getting image as a result which is being generated uh, by native AI. Let's try out some uh, family and uh, restaurant. This prompt and you can see uh, estimated time is also being shared by the grid go which is absolutely amazing uh, because it is the average time we have used this app but hope so it will give us a bit early family in a restaurant app is running is okay so we have a family in a restaurant uh okay cool uh that's I don't know about something. There uh, are cats and okay, meanwhile, it is doing the prediction. We can talk about the code itself. Uh, you can see it is running on the grid. Go the local URL is this. If I say share is equal to true in the launch function of gradio it will create a public link for me which i can share with anyone internet so text to image web app what we are doing is uh, we are requesting a hugging face model which is a stable diffusion xl uh, base 1.0 this is the exact model you don't have to worry about all the details uh, you can just uh, just download the source code and get this app up right there will be a requirement uh, file also you can just uh, install that or you can uh, tell me if you face anything uh, while executing the app so there is a query function which is taking this uh, text as an input and giving us the image back now we can use this image uh, to show in our app and obviously uh, what's in the image it is a byte array we can save it we can display it directly on a notebook so i guess and uh, the output is this image which is the result of astronaut riding a horse okay great uh there are a result a pair of cats in a park background is little blurred but i guess it is actually a park okay so i hope you like the video all the links are in the uh, description you can download the source code from here and let me know what you want in future videos or future product uh, project ideas thanks for watching